52-year-old Stanley Watson of Allenstown is charged with three counts of aggravated felonious sexual assault. The state contends the assaults took place from April of 97 to February of 98 and included threatening one juvenile with punishment unless they agreed to be involved in the sexual assault. We quickly learned Mr. Watson wanted sexual favors in return for the privileges he was receiving. The judge set Watson's bail at $15,000 cash or surety after the defense noted the crimes happened decades ago. Based on the allegations the state has made, there is no indication that uh, Mr. Watson has committed any crimes in the last 20 plus years. 56 year old Jonathan Brand of Concord is charged with two counts of felonious sexual assault. The assaults allegedly happening between March and May of 2007. The assaults, according to the state, took place in the then 14 year old's room during both the daytime and at night. In arguing for personal recognizance bail, the defense made the case that Brand does not pose a risk to anyone been more than 14 years. No action was taken by the state for more than 10 months. And Mr. Brand was aware of these allegations for six months and was law-abiding and not a threat. The judge, however, said there needs to be a significant incentive to show up at court setting bail at $10,000 cash or surety. 52-year-old Trevor Middleton of Belmont is charged with one count of aggravated felonious sexual assault and one count of felonious sexual assault upon a then 14-year-old. His defense relying on similar arguments that it has been a while since these acts took place and Middleton has not been charged with anything else. The judge setting Middleton's bail at $10,000 cash or surety. So far, 11 men have been arrested yesterday, four of them, Frank Davis, James Woodlock, Lucien Poulet and Stephen Murphy waived their probable cause hearings. That means they will await indictment in Superior Court. Reporting live, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.